This is Grindfest Outdoors, St. Paul, Minnesota. So I promised you all a video. Uh, we did a prop uh, speed test with the Beaver Dam Mud Runner on a 1232 John um, last summer. So I've upgraded it, done a stage one. We've got a Beaver Dam Mud Runner custom exhaust. And then I did a air intake uh, and a rejet on the engine. It's a Predator 212. I got the same load running. Um, dozen mallards, dozen teal, half dozen honkers. I got some extra lead in the front to accommodate for my dog. So it's a real world test. We're gonna run through all the props. Uh, this thing is supposed to be doing about nine horsepower now. So we're gonna see whether or not it lives up to the expectation. All right, I got the engine all warmed up and we got a six and a half inch standard prop just like we started the other one. Let's give her a rip. Yeah, so I had an unmodified guy on this last summer. I got an 8.91 on an average speed with this six and a half inch prop. Just got done, 12.18, 36% increase, $100 stage one upgrade. Let's do the rest of these props. With a seven inch standard prop. Yeah, there ain't no joking around about this here. I got like 13 and a half standard, 17 top end. Let's keep her going. That's on the seven inch proper, moving to the seven and a half inch standard. Seven and a half inch standard prop. I got a good feeling about this, boys and girls. This is why having the option of uh, multiple different props to check to see how your engine's gonna do with your load is important because I just got 14.15 on that seven and a half inch prop on this boat. And I'll tell you something, for a 1232 with one dude plus what'll be a dog and some gear, that's pretty damn fast. So let's see how the rest of them roll out. Happy so far. So I appear to have forgotten my eight inch prop. So I apologize for that. We're gonna keep running the test. We're jumping to the eight and a half and see how it does. Uh, probably see a drop in performance here, but I'm thinking that seven and a half is probably about where it's at here. Um, judging by kind of what I saw when I was handling it and how fast it got up. And uh, he's, Robert Milner sent me a couple uh, extra weedless props. So we'll try those out and I'll tack those onto here as well. Those RPMs out. 
out and you gotta dig it down or uh yeah so let's take this sucker off so I got an 11.86 average with that uh, eight and a half inch. I kind of wish I would have brought my eight, but I think we would have seen kind of the same thing where we, where we get that apex of that curve of the power, and then it just kind of gets a little bit rougher with handling. You know, it wasn't a horrible performance. It still is better than the, the last uh, last year when I hadn't modified it. But yeah, your eight and a half is just not going to be the, the prop you want on a small rig like this. All right, so this is a new prop for this video. I didn't have this last summer. This is a six inch weedless prop. Let's give her a go. Six inch weedless. So not a shabby performance out of that old little six inch, but the weedless, I mean, but I kind of got a feeling that six and a half inch weedless is going to give us a go. Let's see how she goes. Got a six and a half inch weedless prop, baby! Really not the performance I was hoping for out of that six and a half inch weedless. It's starting to get kind of dark. But yeah, I had a 12.15, I think, on that six and a half. Let's see how the seven goes, and then I gotta pack it up. Here's why it didn't happen the way I thought it was. Let's cut her out and see how she goes. Let's take two on that six and a half inch weedless. expected 14.04 miles an hour average i like that prop you can dig it in a little bit once you get up going it doesn't cut the rpms down too much uh, once i got it up on plane in the straightaway area i got a good 14 miles an hour pretty pretty consistently let's uh let's run this seven inch and then i think it's done for me for the night because it's getting pretty late Grunfest prediction here is the seven inch weedless is gonna perform the best, which we're about to do, and that seven and a half inch standard prop. So we're gonna check it out. I think that I can get a 15 mile an hour average out of this sucker. We'll see what happens. Star. Seven inch weedless. Huh? 13.41 average out of that seven inch weedless a uh, little bit too much prop for this current setup 
I can just feel it bouncing off the water and uh, I'll tell you that six and a half inch weedless is, is a good good go you know overall a win 30 percent plus performance a uh, hundred dollars I would highly recommend getting this it's a hundred bucks I uh, the, the exhaust itself was like 40 and I spent like 50 bucks or so on the, uh, the, the kit from, from Amazon so you can check out my other videos stay tuned uh, thanks for tuning in take care